I really wish this was a margarita. Do you want to do a Q&A? So this pregnancy has been much easier than last time. Uh, I wasn't sick at the beginning. And I think you're just really distracted having a toddler, but I'm also like really tired and I'm getting uncomfortable early. So I'm ready to meet her. So we got him this baby doll to try and get him used to the idea of having a sibling and he's not into it. So if anyone wants to give me tips, that'd be really helpful. Yes, we have a name, but we're also waiting until she arrives to like completely decide because um, I just don't know if she's gonna look like something else. I mean, they all look like potatoes when they come out, but still. Yes, we have a name. Yes, that's the plan right now. Just two kids. Although I really love being a parent, and if, if I could and I didn't have to be pregnant for like a decade, I would probably have like seven or eight of them. Great question. Uh, this time around, Andy and I just high-fived, and here I am. Oh, I cannot wait for a margarita. This is what, what I dream of at night. Obviously, like, a healthy baby and a safe delivery and then a margarita. I'm going to try, and if it doesn't work, I'm going to give my baby formula, and she will be perfect, and it's totally fine to do that. Does this answer your question? Hmm. So the annoying thing is that this time he's decided, like, it's a great time to get really in shape and work out a lot and get really fit. And I just think that's kind of rude. Like, I feel like he should gain at least 20 pounds. Neither of these things are on Netflix, but um, obviously I loved the Amy Schumer documentary on HBO Max and also Dave on FX, or we watched on Hulu. Um, those are my two favorites. So I try to work out and I've definitely worked out a lot more this time than I did last pregnancy, um, but I just get really bad pelvic pain towards the end and it's hard to move. So um, I do a lot of like this. Lori Bregman, best doula in the whole world. Um, honestly, like I cannot recommend having a doula enough. It was so helpful during my label with James and I cannot wait to work with her again for this baby. So guys, this is a tip for landing a great husband. Um, you just trick them. You make them think that you're cool and fun and funny and then, you know, when they're like really committed, then you just show your true colors. Speaking of great husbands, mine just got home from yet another workout. So I'm gonna go hang with him. I'll try and answer some more questions later. Bye.
So I think it's pretty clear that I'm an expert in all things child related. And I wanted to tell you guys about a book my friend Andy wrote. Do not open this book. Uh, do not buy it. Don't go online looking for it. Do not tell your friends about it. Uh, and if you do come across it, do not open it. You've been warned by us.